Father's Day event right now, which is pretty cool. Look at this billboard. That's a billboard full of products that Marshall sells. You go over there, tell a dad joke, they go up and climb to get you a product. Good morning. <laughs> good morning. So you had a good sleep. So proud of this girl. This is her first time ever sleeping all by herself. Maybe it was comforting being in Kira's bed. Was it? <laughs> Are you having fun here in New York? Okay, the reason we're here in New York City is because we're working with Marshalls. First off, I want to thank you for hosting us and thank you for sponsoring this episode. We're at this Father's Day event right now, which is pretty cool. Look at this billboard. That's a billboard full of products that Marshall sells. You go over there, tell a dad joke, they go up and climb to get you a product. Right in the middle of Flatiron District. Now that we hit up this billboard, we're gonna go to the store and shop for them. Grampy and Papa, of course. Surprise is just around the corner. Good job, I'll follow you, okay? Maybe we should buy this. Oh, I think they would love that. Both Grampy and Papa are sailors. Anything with American flag to celebrate this great country. Grampy or Papa? Oh, so they can play together? All right, I think that'd be good. I'm like kind of a low maintenance dad, and I think a lot of dads, including my dad, is pretty low maintenance, so like we don't really focus on gifts, but what I do know, and this is just a suggestion for anybody buying for their dad, is just surprise them. Surprise them with something. Buy them something they really love, and that's what I love about here at Marshall's. They've got all kinds of outdoor stuff. My dad likes to grill, Papa likes to grill. Boom. That is a gnarly set. That's got everything you ever need. 12 piece stainless steel tool set. And I got you, I got you. Oh, I think they would like that. It's a chair with a cooler underneath it. 24 bucks, $17. I will give that to Papa. Number one dad. Who's the number one dad? You. Oh, thank you. Kind of weird having your daughter buy you a dad gift while you're here with her. You put it in the cart? Well, thank you so much. I'm honored that you think I'm the number one dad. Designer fashion, prices you'll love. Look at this. That's what I'm talking about. 13 bucks. Let's get that for Grampy, but he might need a bigger size little one. Oh, the shorts? This is why you bring your daughter with you shopping because she's looking out for outfits. These are for Grampy. I'm just gonna buy the other ones for Papa. Wait, these pants? Those are perfect for who? Papa. Papa. I don't know why, but that just screams Papa right there. You I think you wear this. How about we choose a few and then I'll try them on. I want you to tell me which one you like the most. Is that cool? All right, I need you to sit patiently, you okay? Should, you should wear this one first. Okay, I'll wear this one first. Um, but the show. Really, my favorite. One, two, three, go. What do you think, little one? <laughs> All right, I'll try the other ones on, okay? Okay, one, two, three, four, five, go. Thumbs up? Yeah. Okay. Was that your favorite one? Yeah. Or did you like the pineapple one? I like I like both of those ones. One, two, three, four, go. Thumbs up? Yeah. My favorite is this pineapple one. My favorite too. <laughs> Grilling set for Grampy, check. Pineapple shorts for Papa, check. Outdoor speaker, probably for me, check. I'm telling you, they got everything. Electronics, I even saw drones, speakers, camping stuff. You're gonna find these items at other stores, but the prices here are way better. Did you pick that unicorn bag? So we just wanna say thank you to Marshalls for having us. Check out Marshalls if you guys wanna get a gift for dads. 
because this is the perfect place to get Father's Day gift. And remember, you're gonna always be surprised with the high quality products at prices you're gonna love. So, thumbs up for Marshall, for little one. I need a cookie, Daniel. <laughs> it rained this morning, so Mother oh, Nature is watering our plants. Of course you need to wash your hands every single time, Miyako. <laughs> Silly. Flowers are beautiful. Thank you so much, Mother Nature, for nourishing our plants. So beautiful. Last night, the girls requested pancakes for breakfast. I want bananas and apples. I might have one more apple left. One full apple. We have some apples. You know We're what? good. I can do this now. Oh, snap. You can. Oh, I get to do it first. Okay, hey, guys, seriously, come on. Okay, I'm putting this away. Yeah, I'm going to You I'll do a while. I'll put that in. It's true. Also have some blueberry for you guys. Would you like that? Mine or Mia's? So I think I, you're gonna like mine. Even mm. Wow, skills! This is day seven. <laughs> Mommy, wash, wash. Oh, hey guys. I forgot I had you on here. Some people in the comments said they notice whiter teeth. I personally don't feel like it looks any different, but. Daily struggle is real. Trying to figure out what we want to do with our hair, which bow to wear. Did you decide yet, JB? No, there's like none. I want a sun. Che oh, check in your bathroom drawer. There's some more hair bows Mommy, over there. I want the, I want, I want the, I want the bow. I want one bow. Oh. So and you don't want that one? The hair tie. Okay. I fix my own hair. I was fixing my hair and then I think I got distracted. You know what? Today's just gonna be a chill day, anyways. The red one. Pretty girl, go look in the mirror. Only blue look hair ties. Touches. There's only blue hair ties. But that would be good. A real, but I don't want that one. Why? I want it to be all blue. Do you see it? You guys are supposed to be sorting through your toys. I asked them to fill this up with toys that they're willing to donate, toys that they don't play with. And you guys have a lot. You know it's a lot when their little toy corner piles into a mountain of random toys. Do we play with this? We're not babies anymore. No, I haven't seen you play with that forever. So yeah, add that to the bag. I would give this to baby Rebecca. Not exactly the cleanest, but this looks a lot better. Thank you, girls, for donating your toys. Thank you, ladies. <laughs> Honey, don't be jelly. 
Don't be jelly. I'm in Laura Vitale's kitchen. That's right! You guys, if you guys don't know, Laura in the kitchen, one of the most famous food YouTubers that I know. Like, this is what she films, isn't that crazy? All the magic happens here. Now, I don't, I don't know what I can show, but Joe is over here. This is Joe, he's behind the scenes. This is little Mia. Little Mia. Hi, you're so beautiful. Anyways, Joe's just showing me the kitchen right now that he built. He built this thing for her channel. You guys say I'm so supportive of Judy. No, this is my inspiration <laughs> guy right here. Anything you want to say, Joe? You're so shy, man. Oh, man. I've been friends with them forever. I, I started talking to Laura like in 2010 or 11. They've just been great supporters of everything, including Dan Summer. They've been on Dan Summer a few times. Steve Harvey, Jamie Oliver, all these food networks network people. Um, I think that today's show is the Good Morning America probably. Megan Kelly? Oh my gosh. The legendary Bobby Flay. But look at this. I'm in the presence of a celebrity and guess what? Upstairs, she's cooking. So we have a winner for the Instagram giveaway. The winner is... The winner is... Emily. Emily. From California. Okay, Emily. So I packed everything yes. and I will ship off tomorrow. I'll be right back. JB, does Mama doesn't have any toys here? I just dropped off the kids at my parents so I could get some editing done and I dropped my laptop. I'm surprised this thing didn't, oh my gosh. Okay, I don't know if you could tell but it has this pretty bad dent in the corner. Please tell me you're working. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, we're good. All right, honey, and sorry, I have to show you this. This is just the <laughs> beginning, I'm guessing. Yes. And Laura's here. The Laura Vitale. Laura in the kitchen. I'm honored. I'm literally, uh, literally, there's millions of people that would see this and be like, how, how? I, are you laughing? You're laughing because I'm, I'm acting like such a fan right now. This is what's the weirdest thing. Number one, I don't watch a lot of YouTube channels other than like informative stuff. I'm like all about news or, you know, geography. But this lady right here is one of the few channels I watch and since forever. And I, look, I, I made your recipe. Risotto. You oh, saw yes, that? You did. You did. You did. And it looked amazing too. I want to be respectful because Here, let me this show is you kind the of, Come on yeah, <laughs> this, this isn't supposed to become like a fan fest where I'm like talking about videos and YouTube or whatever. Even though we are going to talk about YouTube. Honey, honey, I am, I'm sorry. Actually, I'm not really that sorry. You, I guess you could have came. Wine. Look at this. So authentic. I don't feel like garlic. I, oh my gosh, I love garlic. Wow, wow. And this, legit, legit. So it's been an incredibly productive day. Just not that exciting. Like, I'm so jelly. Like, I'm legit jelly right now of Benji. He's eating Laura Vitelli's food. You get to meet baby Mia. But on the bright side, we're about to have some delicious cherries. We have our handy dandy cherry pitter. Thank you, nice Chris. He gave this to us years ago. I think he got it at a store, but you can find this off of Amazon because I know people have been asking where to find this. Ow! I keep stabbing myself. So you put your six cherries in, you close it up, and then the pits are supposed to go on the bottom. So when you open it up, it's de-seeded and you can eat it. Mmm, mmm, they're so juicy. Sometimes the seeds hang out on the bottom, but it looks like you got all of them. Kira was so excited. She even said thank you. How did you like the food? Was it one or two thumbs up? <laughs> two! Whoa! As you can see, I can't even keep food on my plate. This is just the beginning. Thank you! I live to feed people into an uncomfortable oh. position. Oh my so. gosh. I haven't even gotten to the entree yet. No, not yet. Not and I'm in heaven right now. Like, I can't even, like, when me and Joe get together, and, and Laura, but me and Joe specifically, we <laughs> literally can talk for hours, and I love it. But I can't we even, haven't even I, gotten started yet. I can't even concentrate because this food is so good. Molly, how do you like the food? <laughs> Kira was so excited. She even said thank you. How did you like the food? Was it one or two thumbs up? <laughs> two! Whoa! 
are you doing? Dad's making a brownie pie. Wow, she loves to bake at home. She's doing so good. <laughs> Hi, Tiny. Uh, What's the little one next? You want to try me? Want to try? <laughs> Did I taste food out of this book? You know, I don't. <laughs> you guys, go get this book. I've cooked from it. There's some great recipes, but also, if you um, are like everybody else watching this vlog, go to her Thank YouTube you like channel. Happy. Thank you so much, by the oh, way. Oh, you're very welcome. And you know, I don't think the recipes are in I thought the pasta al forno was in there. So that no, means you have to subscribe version. to her channel. There's a vegetable, there's a vegetarian version mm -hmm. of the pasta al forno that I made. One of my favorite dishes is, a, a, there's a peas and pasta dish in here. Oh, yes. But there's the lasagna, which is really similar to what we made. Right there, you guys. Yeah.